Overview of the in vitro micronucleus assay. Micronuclei are extranuclear biomarkers of chromosome damage. Cells are cultured in a laminar flow cabinet. Cells can be cultured in six well plates. Cells are treated with the appropriate test article and incubated with cytoclasin B for 1.5 to 2 cell cycles. Cells are collected and transferred to 15 milliliter centrifuge tubes for the micronucleus harvest. Cultures are then transferred to a centrifuge in order to collect the cell pellet. Cultures are centrifuged at 154 RCF for 5 minutes. Following centrifugation, a cell pellet can be observed. The supernatant is then discarded by pouring. The cell pellet is then resuspended via agitation of the base of the centrifuge tubes. Five millilitres of PBS or phosphate buffered saline is added to each cell culture. This allows washing of the cell cultures and removal of any excess medium. Cells are then treated with potassium chloride and fixed in methanol and acetic acid. Cells are then stored at 4 degrees overnight. Slide making for automated scoring of micronuclei. Slides are prepared by pipetting 100 microliters of cell suspension in fixative directly onto slides. Nuclear staining for micronucleus analysis. Slides are laid flat. These slides have previously had cell suspension pipetted onto them and have been left to dry. Mounting medium containing fluorescent nuclear dye DAPI is then pipetted in small droplets across the length of the slide. A cover slip is then dropped onto the slide in order to enable spreading of DAPI and complete staining. Slides are scored using the semi-automated metaphor microscope system. They are scanned using the 10 times objective under the DAPI filter. Cell images are captured and the gallery is then checked by eye to avoid capturing of false positives and false negatives.